Now to the growing problems for customers who had their credit card information stolen while shopping at Target. Now comes word hackers got their PIN numbers too, and at least one customer is now pleading with his bank for help after he says his bank account was cleaned out. Here's ABC's Rena Ninen. It was a Thanksgiving weekend purchase at Target that Bert Lampley never expected would wipe out his entire bank account. Just taught me a lesson. My debit card will not pay for a retail purchase ever again. Days before Christmas, two unexpected withdrawals totaling almost $350. Charges he says he never made. Lampley believes his card is one of the 40 million breach between November 27th and December 15th. Now Target acknowledging PIN numbers were among the financial information stolen from their systems. Target needs to make sure that however they were able to obtain this data from their systems, from their servers, cannot happen again. Here's why Target believes your PINs are still safe. When a customer enters their PIN, that number is encrypted at the keypad. It's supposed to be highly secure. Target says the PIN is only decrypted by an independent payment processor. Target says, quote, the key necessary to decrypt that data has never existed within Target's system and could not have been taken during this incident. But hackers may still be trying to access PIN information. Once they unencrypt that data, that means that everybody's uh, credit card accounts uh, and bank accounts is potentially vulnerable to being used. As for Lampley, he lives in North Carolina and says the fraudulent charges were made at ATMs near Chicago's O'Hare Airport. The expert we spoke with warns more people may soon see fraudulent charges. I think this situation is going to get a lot worse before it gets any better. Target tells us customers should go to their website, www.corporate.target.com. Lampley says his bank couldn't confirm the source of the breach and that he plans to file a police report Monday. His bank already taking action, David. They've closed his account. All right, thank you.